A Singapore startup has developed a test which can detect COVID-19 by analyzing a person's breath, and it only takes a minute to give the result. The test has been developed by Brithonix, a spin-off company of the National University of Singapore, and they claim that it can even detect early stage or asymptomatic cases. If your body has certain disease, uh, some biochemical pathway will change, and that will be reflected in the concentration of the of the uh, breast molecules. For COVID nineteen, you have infection in your lung, and that will change the metabolism pathway. So uh, some concentration of the molecule will, will change. Unlike the PCR test, which is being used globally for COVID nineteen diagnosis, the breath test is painless, non invasive, and less time consuming. A person is asked to exhale into a disposable tube. A mass spectrometer breaks down the breath into different molecules, which are analyzed by a computer to check for COVID-19 markers. Brithonix says that the speed and ease of testing could make their device an excellent first-level screening tool and reduce the strain on PCR tests. Our machine will mainly be deployed at the high-traffic scenarios like the airport, the shopping malls, conventional centers, the train stations, the border checkpoints, etc. Temperature screening uh, actually cannot identify uh, early stage COVID-19 patients, and some are just asymptomatic. For our test, uh, it can be used at similar situation of temperature screening. However, we won't see this machine deployed this year. The company recently concluded its first clinical trial with Singapore's National Center for Infectious Diseases, where it saw more than 90% accuracy in 180 patients. It is now working with the medical authorities to expand the trial and hopes to get regulatory approval for commercialization by the first quarter of next year. The screening tools such as the antigen and the breath test will complement the PCR swab test, which is still considered the gold standard for COVID diagnosis. The success of rapid testing, though, will be crucial as Singapore gradually opens its borders and slowly resumes more economic activities. Miru Lu, CGTN, Singapore.